Hey everybody, my name is Adam, and welcome to Indie Gameplay for Cooties Patient Zero. Now, before we start this game, I must state that this is a very, very serious issue. Cooties have wiped all emotions out of reason. It has blown up from a small spilled milk to you did what for men and women who have a case of the cooties it has affected so many elementary schoolers that your favorite girl from third grade when she went to fourth grade she contracted cooties and became the fucking bitch that you know today so this is a very serious topic and we are going to divulge in complete accurate biological understanding of cooties because we're going to meet patient zero of course i would like that of course i would like the music on awards and alicados bloody mary sucked i mean that's great that's why they're silver dollar they weren't good enough for your gold can't you read your own list here? No one likes you. Ah. So, Silver Dollar Games has gotten a lot of hate mail from different people. And they put it into their game because they know they're good. And of course, they are the best. But people seem just not to understand how educated they are in programming and design. So let's, let's play. Hey everybody, I'm Dr. Winters. I'm here to explain how cooties work. Now cooties are most commonly contracted by physical contact with the opposite sex. <laughs> cooties can also be rubbed off onto you via clothing or other objects that may be contaminated. And to be fully infected by cooties, one must have continuous prolonged physical contact or multiple brief contacts with the opposite Sex. <laughs> See this cooties bar here? When your cooties bar fills, you've contracted cooties. You understand that, everyone? He's a doctor. He knows what he's talking about. He has pens in his pocket. Red and blue. He knows what the fuck he's talking about. Kyle? Are you there? Yeah, I'm here, Dad. When you're staring death in the face, you realize what's important in life. I may be worth a billion dollars, but companionship, that's priceless. From my understanding, you've never gone on a date. Is that right? You know I have issues with girls. Well, I don't know what kind of psychosis or phobia you have, but you better snap out of it. If you don't get your act together, you might find yourself alone one day. Listen to me, you're not gonna see a dime of my inheritance unless you have a successful date with a girl. You can't just pretend. I mean, you have to genuinely go out on an actual date with a real girl. Coffee, dinner, a movie, you know what I'm talking about. You better get over this cooties thing. Son, life's too short to live it the way you are. If you want my billions of dollars, you'll go on a date. Don't mess it up. If you can do this just once, my lawyers... <laughs> my lawyers will hand over my inheritance to you. If you don't care about the money, then do it for me. I remember when my dad said that on his deathbed. He wasn't actually dying, it was just a bed made of corpses, but I remember this conversation exactly, so it hits close to home. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry I wasn't talking at all. What's a billionaire's dying wish? To have his son go on a date. Yes, you heard it correctly. Billionaire Warren Johnson has informed his lawyers that his only son, Kyle Johnson, is not to see a penny of his inheritance unless he goes on a date with a girl. Apparently, Kyle has a phobia of the opposite sex. His mother died when he was three years old, and Kyle has had little to no contact with women since. 
So to all you single women out there, if you somehow end up on a date with Kyle, you may just be dating a billionaire. It's true, women. Go out with Kyle. Ever since the TV told the world about my fear of women, I've been stalked and harassed everywhere I go. Every girl between here and Timbuktu wants to talk to me. Excuse me. Do you like, mind talking into the glass of water even some more? Not actually I can't. Girls, I can still understand you. Please have some more trees, echo. But they're real. And I'm the only one that can see them. I'm not going to catch them, damn it. I don't care about the money. I'd rather die than catch cooties. Perfect. Let's okay. let's focus on the sink Maybe rather than the toothbrush of what we're trying to it's you know, so yes, and don't even clean up your sink. Leave the hair still there, you know? Who cares, right? Who's this? Oh god, I bet she saw me on TV or something. Do you mind if I sit here? Well, here's the thing. I can either stay away from these cooties, this terrible disease, or I could get a billion dollars. Let's, uh, let's do it for Gramps. Be a billion. Come on, you knew that was a bad choice. Thanks, you're quite a gentleman. Uh, oh, she just touched me, she just touched me. Okay, okay. Stay calm, stay calm. I'm not infected yet. Hi, my name is Alice. Sorry I'm really forward. I hope that's okay. You're forward and I'm awkward, but you have no clue how awkward I really am. She has a cute accent though. I wonder where she's from. hard for me. I've had so many losses with cooties that I'm obligated to just not do it, but a billion dollars. Oops. Be careful. It's nice to meet you. Oh, it burns. Oh no, it burns. Okay. Okay, it doesn't quite burn, but it's still gross. Hi, my name's Kyle. So, you saw me on TV, didn't you? Uh, no. Are you a TV star? You mean, you don't know who I am? No, should I? So, you've seen nothing on the news or anything? Well, I looked up the weather last night. Wait, you're not that guy the cops are looking for. Oh, no, <laughs> not at all. <laughs> yeah, stupid question, forget I said it. Oh, man, maybe she doesn't know about my inheritance. I better be sure. How do we talk to women? Uh, talk about my money? Or be a dick? Be a dick! Hmm, Warren Johnson. Doesn't ring a bell. Sorry, is he someone important? Uh, he's just a guy. It's nothing. Well, I lost my boner. Fuck it. Nope, Amazing. can't do it anymore. She has no clue about my inheritance. This might be the perfect girl to try and date. All right. Well, good thing I'm not she from around me. here, as you probably have guessed. Actually, I don't really notice much. Hey, that's a nice scarf. What material is that? God, she is just taking off her clothes. Hey, well, sorry. I don't like people touching my scarf. It's a weird thing I have. I, I do. I, I'm sorry. So it's a Monday. Shouldn't you be at work or something? I don't really work. <laughs> I right am now. at work. I mean, I'm talking to you, sugar tits. I'm kind of in between things. She doesn't I even do have sugar tits. Just not at a company. In fact, they're kind of just like Anyways, brown paper bags. You're probably wondering why I'm not working either. That have a sandwich in them. Wait, what was the question? Um, it's Monday. I'm here visiting my boyfriend. I don't have to worry about working because he pays for everything. Just kidding. 
I don't have a boyfriend. I'm also in between jobs at the moment. Why would you fucking lie to me, you son of a bitch? I hope you're not weirded out by me. I just saw you there in the corner and thought you looked interesting. I'm not crazy or anything. Well, maybe a little. You no say you're way. not crazy, I, I and then you give cool. me that you're stare. You're the first real girl I've met in a long time. And you oh, give me that girl. smile. Just kidding. I, uh, I, 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 no, no, don't touch me. Wow, those are some cat-like reflexes you got there. Thank you. So tell me about yourself. Uh, well, where do I start? How about I start by telling her I'm afraid of all human contact with women? You're yeah, right. Not much to tell, really. Dude, I play video games like 10 hours. That impresses women. I'm not kidding. Yeah, I play a shitload of games. It's probably not healthy, and I'm fully aware of that. When I'm not playing games, I'm selling plastic models online. It's like a hobby slash business. <laughs> She's so interested. Well, I paint the models first, of course. Of course. Yeah, the models are actually really small. It's hard to get all the little details. It takes a steady hand. Let's see how steady your hands are. You know, I'll prove her wrong. She can fucking touch my hands because I have steady fucking hands. That was too close. Oh, gross. So gross. I can feel the cooties on my skin. They don't seem steady to me right now. Yes, so... miniatures. That's what I do. I paint miniatures. Then I sell them. That's cool. It is. I've never even heard of a thing like that before. Maybe that's because it's the geekiest thing ever. Hey, do you want to go to lunch with me? What, like now? Yeah, right now. Why not go Am I all paying out for your meal? You, you want that inheritance, Kyle? Make this work. This is your shot. You can do this. All right, Are you okay, that desperate? Let's do it. Let's get out of here. There's a pub right around the corner. Let's go there. Okay, okay, just get through this, and the inheritance is all mine. I'm starving. What are you thinking of getting? Can I see the menu? Uh, okay. I'll just get that myself. <laughs> Damn straight you will, bitch. I'm not giving you anything. Really if you're not gonna be working for your money, I'm not gonna give you my do. billion dollars. I, I mean... Don't really go on dates. No! No, you can't touch me! Don't touch me! Relax, you're doing fine. Oh, that was a close one. Too close. Don't you dare fucking touch Let's me. Let's order. Bitch. I'm hungry. Yeah, <laughs> good idea. I need a drink. Maybe if I'm drunk, I won't worry about cooties so much. Hmm, that might just work. That is oh, a good suggestion. Working. Can you pass me the salt, please? It's right there! No, you've just contracted the cooties. That's so gross. I... Wait, do I have to start over again? Hey! Kyle? Oh my god, I gotta... I gotta start over again. Nope. No. 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 That's a fucking worse game. Nah, there, there's a lot of worse games. But, um... I don't want to... I j <clears throat> I'm so frustrated right now. But you know what? I'll get back to where I was. And we'll just continue. Ugh, this is not working. And Can we're back, and I only salt, messed up please? once, so that's why I still have our cootie shot. Um... Here you go. That wasn't too hard. Maybe I can finish this date after all. You don't have to act so nervous around me. <gasps> you got chicken bite. nuggets! I'm generally nervous around women. <laughs> why is that? Oh, that's it. 
I'm just gonna have to come out and say it. I have a phobia of girls. Yeah, I'm pretty much afraid of any kind of physical contact with girls. I should keep the cuties thing to myself. I'm not sure how she would react to that. So if I was to reach out to you and touch your hand, would you freak out? No! 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 Wow, you really are afraid. Yeah, I've learned to move quickly. <laughs> Actually, there's more. You're not afraid of girls talking to you, are you? <laughs> no, I don't think so. No, the reason I asked if you've seen me on TV is... Did she just get a plate of fries? My dad and my inheritance. Is your dad loaded or something? Well, yeah. He's worth about a billion dollars, and a large portion of that might come my way. <laughs> Let her touch you, you son of a bitch! Shut up! You're lying, aren't you? I don't believe you! Good, then leave no, me alone! It's true. He was on the news, so I thought you might have recognized him, or me, or something. I don't know. So I guess lunch is on you. Well, the thing is, I don't have any, <laughs> any money <laughs> at the moment. You're fucking He's losing. holding all the inheritance from me unless I Excuse go me? on a date. <laughs> That's what her face is. You're kidding me. That's the strangest thing I've ever heard. I know, it's mental, really. So what should we do about this? Oops. Be careful. We can beat this phobia together. Oh, here we go again. More goodies coming my way. Uh, so, how do we beat this thing? Well, let's go back to your place, and we can finish the date there. Sounds like a plan. Dude, is he gonna get vagina stabbed? Thanks, millionaire. Only if I can survive the rest of this date. Billionaire, not millionaire. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, so what do we do now? Now, we're gonna beat this fear you have. Alice, I've been trying for years. How are we gonna do that? Well, you're afraid of human contact, right? Uh, just contact with girls, actually. Okay, well, it's time you actually hug a girl. Oh, come on, you knew that was a bad choice. No, I didn't. Yes, you can. All you have to do is try. This is going to suck. Oh, God, if I have to actually, continue again. Die from it. Think. Come on, stand up. Come on, get up. I really can't do this. Trust me, nothing's gonna happen. I promise. After this, I'll stop bugging you. And then you could collect your millions. You lied to me. Did I really? I was just trying to keep you safe. I was trying to protect you. You told me if I touched girls, I would get cooties. I know what I said, but we can still be friends, right? It's over, and I want you to leave. <laughs> you made the doctor upset, Kyle. You're a fucking dick. What were you just doing? Just getting rid of voices in my head. <laughs> I'm kidding, but not really. Okay, well, this was entertaining, to say the least. Here's my number. What do I do with this? Call it silly. I... Alright, well... Well, everyone, that was Cooties, patient zero. And that is the reason why Silver Dollar Games Sucks donkey balls! I'm kidding, they're golden. Cooties are terrible, though. Go to your doctor, because you may have contracted them by watching this video. Fucking go!